And, of course, you know, everything we do in the sub four-minute mile is kind of capsulizes. It, it takes the training process, the motivation process, the goal-setting process that Roger Bannister so well illustrates and he used so successfully to run the sub four-minute mile. Trained, didn't have much time at all. He was a busy pre-med student at Oxford University, neurobiology, 30 minutes a day. Defied any conventional standard of training not to mention going for that goal, was not, quote-unquote, encouraged. He did it in short, regular, focused, intense, intended training sessions. You're going to get an example today. That's what we do in every single session. Every single volume has 19 training sessions in it to help you redefine personal possibility. Here we are today in this volume. Of course, I will read the Dream Design Dare, the title piece. I always like to point out a couple other titles. They're, they're all good, I tell you. Some of them we've had more comment on. Some of them, they're different things. Today, we have quantum science, which explains it is a spiritual universe. Very, very powerful concept. Here's one, marketer. The marketing lesson in a $129 cup of coffee. You might think I'm exaggerating. There is a significant marketing lesson there. Title here. Youthfulness might be a better word than young. Crushing it in business with the gladiator mindset in business. And our title piece, the one that we're going to look at closely, is Dream Design Dare. Here we are, just as the book looks like when you get it at Amazon.com, because this is it. Dream Design Dare. Looking at the future is an interesting episode and event. Yes, we happen to be planning the future for the next three to five years in our company right now. As you would expect, the future for the next one year is what we're really most focused on. Although everything correlates and coordinates with reasons for being, objectives and plans with much further horizons, everything depends on our performance right here, right now. That's when consciously creating the future rather than just arriving in and responding to whatever comes takes place. And looking at the future is an interesting episode because it allows you not only to see, not only to be inspired with the methods you need to foster the events you need to pass to create the envisioned future, but it also leaves you with an uncanny realization of how much it is we actually do, can control and operate our individual, be that company or enterprise-wise, realities. Yes, it is a world of cause and effect. We can get conscious. To do that, you start with the effect you'd want and work back what causes would I have to put in place to have them be the effect, that effect being the riches that I seek as I seek them. It's all individual to you, my friend. Yes, a good place to start is by completing the formula for riches, which is in Chapter 1 of The New Think and Grow Rich. It asks directly, How much? Or what do you want? No pussyfooting around. How much, what do you want? No pussyfooting around. By when? No pussyfooting around. How are you going to get it? What are you going to deliver? Now this, of course, is your best jump right now, and you, re you have the authoritative commandment to and permission. You will revise. And finally, what are your plans? What are your plans? What 
just just for instance, let's just say that you've decided that you're going to be a dancer in Los Angeles, but you're living right now in a suburb of Spokane. That several hundred good miles of distance, depending on all kinds of variables, age, what you're involved in. Obviously, if you're in school, you're going to finish school. Et cetera, et cetera. You're individual to your case. What are your plans? You know what you're going to end up with. These are not unnecessary questions, these four. How much? What do you want? By when? How are you going to get it? What are your plans? These are the questions of your life. You can create the life you want when you move forward on the dreams and designs of your heart if you dare dream them and move on them. It's here and now you choose and plant the experiences of your upcoming days. Dream. Design. Dare. My friend. Ted Siuba, so glad to be with you. We have just conclusion of author review of Dream Design Dare, volume 26 in a sub four minute extra mile series. There's so much more than that. We just did the title training session. Find out your copy available at thinkrich.com forward slash dare. I dare you. Thinkrich.com forward slash dare.